57 year old Rebecca Piri was born here. She says service delivery is a foreign concept to her. Every day, residents cross this makeshift bridge to reach school and work. In another nearby community, sanitation is lacking. Residents share a communal tap and refuse lies uncollected. Illegal electricity connections are also rife in this area. Last week, the ANC-led council failed to meet its deadline to approve the budget. The previous DA coalition council also failed to approve a budget on three separate occasions. Provincial authorities are refusing to dissolve or place the municipality under administration just yet. He is now in discussion with his ex-colleagues, including the MEC for Finance, to ensure that in the meantime we have an interim budget approved by the MEC for Finance uh, so that they are able to operate as a municipality. So within that 90 days, we will be working as COCTA to ensure that the budget and the IDP is um, approved. If they are not, then we will explore other means within the law. Is the MEC not stalling here? Because this is not the first time budgets have not been approved in that municipality. We are not stalling. What we are doing is to ensure that we explore all possible means within the law to ensure that people of Mukhali City are not affected. Putting politics aside, the residents are clear about their demands. We want a service delivery. How, we don't know. But we want a service delivery. Because it's almost 22 years. It's local. Malungi Elubui, Maldestrift.